The Kinks were an English rock band formed in Muswell Hill, North London, in 1963 by brothers Ray and Dave Davis. They are regarded as one of the most influential rock bands of the 1960s. The band emerged during the height of British rhythm and blues and mercy beat, and were briefly part of the British invasion of the United States until their touring ban in 1965. Their third single, The Ray Davis Penned You Really Got Me, became an international hit, topping the charts in the United Kingdom and reaching the top 10 in the United States. The Kinks' music drew from a wide range of influences, including American R&B and rock and roll initially, and later adopting British music hall, folk, and country. The band gained a reputation for reflecting English culture and lifestyle, fueled by Ray Davis' wittily observational writing style, and made apparent in albums such as Face to Face, 1966, Something Else, 1967, The Village Green Preservation Society, 1968, Arthur, 1969, Lola vs. Powerman, 1970, and Muswell Hillbillies, 1971, along with their accompanying singles including the transatlantic hit Lola, 1970. After a fallow period in the mid-1970s, the band experienced a revival during the late 1970s and early 1980s with their album Sleepwalker, 1977, Misfits, 1978, Low Budget, 1979, Give the People What They Want, 1981 and State of Confusion, 1983, the last of which produced one of the band's most successful U.S. hits, Come Dancing. In addition, groups such as Van Halen, The Jam, The Knack, The Pretenders and The Romantics covered their songs, helping to boost the Kinks record sales. In the 1990s, Britpop acts such as Blur and Oasis cited the band as a major influence. Ray Davis, Rhythm Guitar, Lead Vocals, Keyboards, and Dave Davis, Lead Guitar, vocals, remain members throughout the band's 33-year run. Longest serving member Mick Avery, drums and percussion, was replaced by Bob Henry, formerly of Argent, in 1984. Original bass guitarist Pete Kife was replaced by John Dalton in 1969. After Dalton's 1976 departure, Andy Pyle briefly served as the band's bassist before being replaced by Argent bassist Jem Rodford in 1978. Session keyboardist Nicky Hopkins accompanied the band in the studio for many of their recordings in the mid to late 1960s. The band became an official five-piece in 1970, when keyboardist John Gosling joined them. Gosling quit in 1978, he was first replaced by ex-Pretty Things member Gordon Edwards, then more permanently by Ian Gibbons in 1979. The band gave its last public performance in 1996 and broke up in 1997 as a result of creative tension between the Davis brothers. The Kings have had five top 10 singles on the US Billboard chart.